Good morning, guys. So today, something really cool came in the mail. How's your potty training going? Good. So a while back, I ordered a signed CD from Brian Lanning, and it finally came today in this red packaging. So I'm gonna show you guys what's inside, and you can probably hear a little rumbling action going on. So first thing inside is this CD. Let's open the CD. I'm like throwing this thing around. Oops. So inside, we have the signed Brian Lanning CD, and that is like super, super cool. I can't believe, I can't believe I have one. He also sent this, a fake hundred dollar bill, but it's signed by Brian, you rock. It's a little note. So that is super, super cool. Let's see if it'll focus, there it is. And also there's a whole bunch of little mini diamond confetti, which you can hear in the packaging that got literally all over my room. That's how excited I was when I opened the thing and just boom. You wanna wear the Moana dress? Yeah. You want me to put it on? Okay. Moana, make way, make way, Moana, it's time you knew. The village of Montanui is all you need. You love Moana? Madison wants to say hello to the vlog. Say hi. Hi. What are you eating? Ice cream. Mm, chocolate ice cream. It's those uh, little drumstick, little mini things that you can get from like the wholesale stores. Ice cream machine. They're so good, but on my diet I can't eat them. <sighs> we got these, um... Oh, what what do you call them? They're like popsicle sticks, but they're frozen yogurt, and they're really, really, really good. Daddy. And also, like this uh, ice cream brand called Halo Top has fat-free ice cream. Uh, it's like fat-free. Um, yeah. I don't know if it's fat-free. I think it has it has a little yeah. bit of fat. It's got really low carbs, but it's healthy to eat. And the whole yeah. tub, it's like a pint of ice cream. But the pint of ice cream is only 320 calories. I gotta go get Chase off the bus, so I'll be back after that. You got your own ice cream now. Yeah. Yeah? I got full of ice cream. Yeah? Hey, Bordy, how was school? Good. Hi, everybody. How's your potty training going? Good. Really good? Yeah. yeah. So I just wanted to give you guys a little update on Stella's potty training. We got this really cool potty from BJ's. And it's got like a closing lid and stuff. I'm not gonna show you inside because she actually did a little bit just before. And there was a little top on here. I don't know where that went, but it had a little button that made flushing noises. And it's got this really cool toilet paper holder. So it's been a while since we talked about Stella's potty training, and that was like the initial first time we started doing it. So now, a month later, she's basically fully potty trained. We've been diaper free for a month now. Right, Stella? Yeah. No more diapers. The one thing she does have a problem with, though, is pulling down her pants to go on her potty. And it'll sometimes get caught up on her and she'll, like, go to sit down and it'll just be in the way. So that's the only issue we really have. And she hasn't really grasped the concept of wiping. So that's another thing we have to look for, especially if, like, if she poops, she'll put her underwear right back on if we're not, like, on top of it. That's one thing we gotta work on. But it's really nice not having to change a diaper. So the other thing that she really likes to do is she likes to dump her potty by herself and she'll again just go and do it and she she makes a mess a little bit and she's actually kind of really good at it but that's another thing we have to watch her and make sure she don't spill that's snow white i don't know snow white's husband thing prince charming no that's daddy that's me yeah that's not daddy apparently that's me right there who would have thought does that even look like me does it look like me let me know but yeah, that's Stella's potty training. All right, that looks yummy. What are you making? My own tuna fish. Your own tuna fish? Yummy. I'm going to eat some. Mm -mm. Uh, I'm going to eat some. Yeah. Yes, I am. <laughs> All right, guys. <laughs> The kids have been begging me to watch Harry Potter and we've been doing movie nights where we've been watching Harry Potter's one through three We watched three last night and the kids love that one That one's actually my personal favorite, but they really want to watch the fourth Harry Potter, which is the Goblet of Fire I have to clean up this mess of a floor to get them some Why am I still holding it up? To get them some floor space so they can lay down The kids are actually playing Harry Potter right now and it's the cutest thing Can I see what you're using for a wand? Pencil. 
<laughs> All right, whatever floats your boat. We I used to play with twigs in the backyard as a wand. Ridiculous! Ridiculous! I got a pen too. This is a Christmas tree. Yeah, ridiculous! 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 Oh. So once again, the children loved Harry Potter. They loved the movie. They all fell asleep right after the movie, which was really good. We actually started movie night. Um, around like six o'clock and the movie was over by eight. So they were like really like knocked out right after that That'll lead me on to question of the day So my question to you guys and answer down in the comments below is what is your favorite Harry Potter movie?